diseases of coronation uh, now we will see the list of important diseases in coronation my name is janat shankar reddy and i am doing phd plan pathology in university so these are all the list of important diseases in uh, coronation the first one is fusarium wilt which is caused by fusarium axis from pharma species dianthi second one is alternary leaf spot which is caused by alternary dianthi third one is bacterial wilt which is caused by burkhold area karyophily so now we'll see in detail about one by one so first one is a fusarium wilt which is caused by fusarium oxysporum pharma species dianthi so if you see if you see the symptoms uh, here lower leaves uh, lower leaves are yellow and uh, one side of the plant turns into uh, like you know uh, one side of the plant maybe will uh, remaining uh, uh, next side of the plant is uh, quite okay so symptoms are uh, progress in plant and they can spread to the other parts also in later stages so in uh, in, in severe cases what will happen the stem entire rot stem and as well as the root rots and completely it look like a, a, a wilting or a, a completely it look like a wilting like symptoms can be developed so coming to the management aspects uh, so if the disease plants were identified it's better to remove immediately and uh, uh, if uh, you know uh, if you found that uh, you know uh, fusarium wilt infected plants you can uh, especially in the root cis in the root region you can completely dig it out the soil and like, expose it to the uh, expose it to the uh, sunlight uh, careful or expose to outside carefully and we can also use soil solarization at, with a clear transparent polythene film that is uh, uh 0.1% thickness concentration uh, can be used for uh, 30 days then definitely give a satisfactory result because the uh, soil solarization is especially meant for uh, uh, soil bone diseases so coming to the alternary leaf spot second one which is caused by alternary dianthi so if you see here the small purple color if you see here small purple color spots can be seen on leaves and you can also see uh, uh, purple color spots with uh, a black color center right so purple color spots with a black color center can be clearly seen in pod also uh, i mean that is in uh, a flower bloom uh, that is what we call bloom whatever whatever we call called it, call it is so initially small purple spots on leaves so uh, later stages what will happen they completely turned into brown color and uh, slowly leaf starts to yellow in color we can also see the same symptoms in uh, uh, the uh, flower initiation area so third this is bacterial wilt which is caused by burkhold area karyophily so if you see here uh, the symptoms are uh, uh, wilting curling and uh, stunting of lower leaves especially so wilting curling twisting of uh, uh, twisting and stunting of lower leaves can be especially observed in later stages the death of leaves low, lower leaves especially death of lower leaves can uh, can be observed so wilted plants may be recovered again if you are providing a proper uh, nutrition uh, so not nutrition if you are providing a proper management practi practices so uh you know yellowish green spots also can be uh, clean uh, can be observed in some stages but the major symptoms are wilting twisting and curling of the leaves and uh, these are all the important uh, uh, symptoms of bacterial wilt so coming to the management aspects uh, so you know uh, better to select a healthy stocks so selection of healthy stocks are uh, very very uh, important if there is any uh, uh, plant debris or any uh, Uh, already uh, stubbles from the previous uh, cropping season are found it's better to collect and burn and then uh, diseased free planting material or diseased free planting root stocks can be used for uh, propagation so root cultivars like elegans northland and starlight are the less susceptible varieties for the bacterial wilt so better to go with this uh, uh, this uh, uh, root cultivars so coming to the aerus or not uh, we can expect causal organisms so rather than that uh, uh, there is no important uh, uh, questions that we can expect from this but the definitely causal organisms are uh, uh, we can expect we might expect causal organism from any uh, any crop so not only uh, flower crops but also for other crops also